Okay, so um, if you're watching these in the order that I'm uploading them, then you'll see I'm returning back to uh, the fifth Adological Enigma. Um, however, I think I'm going to upload this as part of, I'm going to, I'm going to name it at least like the, the, I don't know how many parts this took me, but the, if it took me N parts to do this puzzle, this is going to be parts N plus one. Um, and it's just going to be part of that series of videos, even though I'm doing it way later. And the reason I'm returning to it is because I've found out that this thing down here means something. Um, and also some of the things I've noticed in earlier puzzles, um, well, no, later puzzles. <laughs> um, some of the things I saw were related to this number down here. Um, so this number is the number of Easter eggs in this puzzle. Uh, so it turns out not only is there the overall puzzle that I have to do, but there are other puzzles hidden within it. So I'm going to somehow attempt to do them. The only problem is how do I, how do I confirm the answer? I guess the main puzzles have sort of that problem, but I always end up with a, not really like, ob obviously this is the answer. Uh, it's not always necessarily obvious that this is the answer. Like, like maybe I, I might be misinterpreting it. I might be Googling badly or whatever, but, um, it's, you know, I'm pretty certain. However, like, so there are two Easter eggs in this. How can I possibly know when I've done them? Hmm. Um, so in, in, uh, in trying to understand what these Easter eggs even are or like what form they take, I did look at one. Uh, so it wasn't for this puzzle. It was for the one that I had noticed in the game. So it's puzzle 10, maybe, uh, the one where, um, uh, oh, I guess if I say the answer, so the one where I'm coloring in, uh, rotationally symmetric shapes. Um, so I looked up how it works for that one, uh, just so I had some idea of what, what on earth I was doing. Um, and I kind of get it. Basically I expect there to be some, some extra information in here that I can extract, um, in some form, like, uh, basically it feels like it could be anything though. Um, but I guess I, it gave, it gave me an idea of the kind of things to look for, like kind of visual things or, or not. I have no idea. Um, okay. So where to begin even. Uh, so I don't see, I mean, the, the pattern itself looks pretty random. Noticeable things. The noticeable things, that's where to begin. What is noticeable? There's a good word for that, that people use in puzzle design. Not noticeable. Yeah, I can't remember the word, but there is one. Um, anyway, so, okay, the spaces that are empty, like that. What an awful circle that was. And another one, whatever. Uh, like, I don't see how these could be related to anything though. Uh, there's also like the shape isn't particularly useful. There's the shape of the whole thing. Mm. I don't see any, it's not like it's a picture or, or, a, or any letters or anything like that. There's the shape of these like the actual like white and black squares. It's not symmetric. I can't see much of a pattern to anything. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 10, 11, 12, 13. So 13 is kind of awkward. <laughs> Because it doesn't divide into anything. 
except itself in one, of course. Um, so it's not like I could split things up in threes or whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three. Uh, also awkward. Okay. So I imagine I'm not dividing the grid up. Wait, so there are the letters going backwards. Is that backwards? Which way did this go? Oh yeah, because that's gate two, that's gate one. So that's, that's gate one going in the direction. So there are, okay, there's some extra information that I haven't used yet. It's just there and it was pointless. Okay, that's totally gonna be it. Uh, they wouldn't just, it wouldn't just be there for no reason. Well, I guess the reason might be that it, it makes it unclear which direction is the right direction. Like the whole point of the original puzzle is you don't know which way is, you know, which way we go through the two. If, the, if it, there was a letter just going one direction, then we'd know. Although it could have been the same letter in both directions. Okay, that convinces me, maybe. Uh, so wait, so that way was the way before. So this way. I'm, I'm also worried though, because there's two Easter eggs. <laughs> oh dear. Um, anyway. So how's this going to work? So is this gate one now? And that's gate two? Let's see what happens. Uh, so J plus one. I've still got this there. That's good. Um, in fact, I guess I'm going to be writing. So let's do this. Uh, J plus one is K. V plus two is uh, X. Okay, this does not feel good yet. Uh, D plus three, one, two, three. Yep, yeah, cooks that's that's not it. Uh, unless what we do is that was I think that was the total number of gates. In fact, that would be why that's useful as well. I did wonder that at the time. Like why there are there's, there's twenty five gates. Why would you write well? Eh, why like I, I was thinking why write the number because I can just easily see that there are twenty five gates. I guess it helps you, uh, stops you from counting it, but it also makes it nice now coming back to it because I can be like, oh, so this is gate 25. So, so J plus 25, wow. Okay, uh, 10 to T, 10 to T? <laughs> 10 to T, uh, six more to Z, so D, that's 20, 25, one, two, three, four, five, I. Could be a sentence. I'm in a different font. I, I don't know what font I was using before. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, oh no. I replaced it with a tab. Okay, hold on. Myriad Pro, apparently. And what am I now? Roboto Mono. La, la 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 Consistency. Myriad Pro. There we go. So I. <laughs> ah. Okay. T to get for text? Yeah, okay. I. I feel like I'm also bold. <laughs> no, I just replaced it again. It, uh, the only thing is it's tab to bring up all the the windowy stuff. Um, so hold on. Yes, I'm bold. Regular. Okay. Move you there. Oh no, let's tab away again. Uh, T. Back into the text. Okay. I. So tw uh, V plus twenty four. 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, T, it. This is better, at least. D, 23. Whew. So that's 20, 1, 2, 3, A. T, 22. Uh, so... D is 10, it's a P. It, it app, I mean, it still could form a valid sentence. Um, uh, U plus 21. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, O, P. Ooh. I tap. It apparently, I don't know, K, 20, uh, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. It app appends. Uh, is that an H? I think it is. H. Plus nineteen. Eh, a. It, it appears. Okay, this is it. Holy crap! Something's happening. Uh, K uh, H Z eighteen. So it's just the eighteenth letter of the alphabet. So R. It appears. B plus seventeen. Ten. Ten, uh, what are we doing? 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. Peers, I, 16. 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It appears, uh, Z plus, what was it? That was 16, 15, Z plus 15. So 15 class of the alphabet is O. It appears U, probably. E plus 14, oh no, wait, E, no, G plus 14, I missed one, uh, which is U, E plus 13, one, two, three, oh, it might be your, it appears your, or you are, you, you are, um, S plus, what was that? Uh, S plus 12? Yep. Well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Maybe, yeah. 11, uh, I plus 11. Bloop, bloop, T. K plus 10. U. I plus nine R turning to, I don't know. Uh, F plus eight N, yes. X plus seven. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, is that right? Okay, so that's, that, that's 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, X plus 7, 1, 2, yeah, okay, well, I guess, I don't know why I, I think E feels wrong, but this does, uh, X plus 6, uh, so D, you're turned... V plus five, one, two, three, four, five, around. Oh, ha, 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 nice. <laughs> X plus four. Oh, no, it's not. X, one, two, three, four. Turned about, okay. Uh, L 
plus three, one, two, three, two, uh, L, uh, two S plus two, U and S plus one, T. Ta -da! That's kind of fun actually, because like if you did, <laughs> If you did just like solve it normally and then accidentally went the wrong direction. Oh no, you couldn't accidentally go the wrong direction, right? I mean, what does it say? Uh, let's complete this slalom run. You can move on to find the final estimating. But we trace the scheme, we'd go through the case in ascending order. Like going backwards would be silly. Why would you ever do that? Uh, but cool. Okay, so I found one. Um, I'm wondering, does the example have the same thing? Because if there's two Easter eggs, maybe that just means you just do it there and there. Because, okay, I cannot think of any other information that I can get out of this. I've already tried going backwards, but using the ascending numbers. You could go forwards and use the... I mean, no, for the letters to be able to make two sentences using two completely different sets of offsets. That would be crazy. I just don't expect it could possibly be true. So maybe doing the same thing here works. Um, uh, and in fact, I don't have to solve it because <laughs> this is an example that's already solved for me. Um, so what we're we saying, uh, go backwards from the four and do W plus four. One, two, three, four. Is that what I did? Yes, W plus four. Oh, and I can't draw. Uh, A. K plus three. One, two, three, N. A plus two, C. Um, a plus one B and cub. Okay. Uh, not that. A and C B. Maybe this is the other direction. Hold on. So maybe it is that direction that you do, but it'd be weird for it to be like a completely different thing. Maybe it's not in there at all. Oh dear. Let's go, okay, hold on. Let's go backwards and do uh, W plus, what would it be, one? <laughs> X, not a good start. Uh, K plus two, M, no, X men. <laughs> Could be. Uh, Let's keep going. A plus three. Almost. Oh, that's going to be a D. Uh, and then A plus four. E. No. Uh oh. What else then? There's two Easter eggs. I've done one. Like I'm, I'm also thinking like, what if I could select letters based on something like? There's just so many X's in here though, and Z's like. There's too many to make a real sentence. Like, what if all the letters inside? somehow make something, but I need a real pattern. That's not a real pattern. Well, if I follow along one side of the line, D, well, it could be something like hugging the edge, D, B, I, A, J, Y, X, B, I mean, it's just gibberish. Or, you know, just reading letters top to bottom, X, Xid, Xiv, Xiv, there's too many X's. Uh, 
get. I mean, it's, it's not a, a word search. <laughs> get. It's just, there's no logic to that. Um, let's double check I did this one right. Um, what was the logic? So start at the end and do just do the reverse letters plus the number of the gate. Okay, start at the end. So uh, start at the end. So the first gate is that one, it's the fourth gate. So it's W plus four. W one is A. Is that what I had last time? I think I did. And then it's K plus three. One, two, three. Yeah, and could put something like that. A plus two C A plus one B. Unless that means something that I just don't know. I don't think so. The letters up here are much nicer than those Zs. But what? B A K Backy <laughs> A or if I hook the outside A A C A, A, what's the size of this grid? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, obviously it's a square. I can see it's a square. Um, all right. Um, yeah, this is going to be a problem with these things. How am I going to know when I found an answer? And how do I know when to stop? I guess I just stop when I have no ideas. This was cafe. That's unrelated to the thing, right? Yeah, because it was about winter sports, the Winter Olympics. It's just cafe. Mm, okay, hold on. So if I read this top to bottom, back, away, does that mean something? It's two words. B A C K A W A Y, yeah. Back away. Is it like saying, <laughs> go away? Uh, is it a slalom term? Back away? It appears you're turned about. Like, it could be a message to me. Like, maybe? <laughs> Why? The other one makes a lot more sense, obviously, because I did the thing backwards, so it appears you're turned about. I don't know. This is something else, because I mean, those are nice letters to make a word out of. Way back, but then I've got an extra A. But it's not just going to be an anagram. I don't have to make an anagram of these letters. But if, maybe it's letters within an area, K-A-Y-B. I can't make any words out of that. W C A A. Mm, I don't know. Uh, 
I mean, it's a sentence. <laughs> back, back away. I mean, it's, I mean, it's not just a sentence. It's a phrase. You would tell somebody to back away. Like that's pretty strong. It just doesn't seem to connect to anything. It's weird that the backwards letters on here. Okay, like, okay, that's the thing that's bothering me. The reason the backwards letters were important on the other one were because, because, because they were, I mean, not the reason they were important, but the reason I realized they were important is because they were there. Like, if they, if they weren't important, they wouldn't be there. Whereas this one, they've used the letters going forwards to make cafe, but not the ones going backwards. But everything I've tried to go backwards hasn't come up with anything. What do we have? We have W. This is right down. W, K. A and A waka waka. That's the noise Pac Man makes. There we go. <laughs> Done. That must be it. <laughs> That's the answer. <laughs> uh. I mean, okay, maybe I just take that as something, but it seems random and unconnected. Like I'll just stare at this forever. Those backwards letters, backwards letters. W A K A, and I've got the numbers one, two, and three, four to adjust them by. But there's only two sensible ways of doing that. Either it's like plus one, plus two, plus three, plus four, or it's, oh, unless it's minus. Why would it be minus? Why would it be changing things? I don't know. Let's try it anyway. Uh, w, wait, uh, yes, W minus one, maybe? V. K minus two I A minus three Vixen Vixa uh, A minus four Vixu uh, We could try W minus minus four one, two, three, four, S. I like words beginning with S. Uh, K minus three. One, two, three. <laughs> uh, okay. A minus two. I mean, this is always going to be bad. Shy. And then A minus one, Z. Shies. I don't know, I don't think it's it. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to stick with that, and I don't know. It sounds okay. The other one was good. It appears you're turned about. I think that's a fruitful Easter egg hunting. Or an eggful, an eggful hunting. Um, yeah, I guess I'll move on to another one.